What's up guys, we're back for another Fallout 4 walkthrough. Today we are continuing on with the Minutemen questline. And where we are is right of pretty much everywhere we've been so far. And now let's go talk to this person. What do you want? Damn, they're packing the heat. Trouble around here. Didn't you ask the Minutemen for help? You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still existed. We sent word with one of them passing traders, but honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days after Quincy. Bad business, that. We're rebuilding the Minutemen from the ground up. We're the good guys again. Glad to hear it. No question that things have been worse since the Minutemen fell to pieces. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies, threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. Don't worry. I'll take care of those raiders for you. Thanks, friend. If you folks are for real this time, it'll be a welcome change for the better. And to the raiders we go. Okay, so I just pretty much cut out the time of me walking. Now there's gonna be a turret and some people out here. I already took care of most of them except for this guy. That doesn't seem to want to die and I'm not gonna waste my ammo. So I came in here and took most people out. Guess I forgot about her. And she is uh getting beat down by me and my dog. I have no idea where those people with the grenades came from. And her body is gone. It looks like she had some good stuff to loot. Well, I guess we can move on. Just search to make sure nobody respawned or... Because I didn't kill everybody in here. Just continue down this hallway. And you don't need to go through that door. You can just go up these stairs. Keep going. Eventually you'll hit this room. And the... The, um... Leader of the Raiders is in here. I've died... Quite a few times trying to kill him. There's two turrets and a bunch of people up here. So I found out that... This was the best way to do it. You sneak around, he always runs into that room. You throw like a grenade or something up there. You get the kill, and then you just you run. That turret will mess you up. And from here, there's pretty much nobody else. But outside here, there was quite a bit of a ghoul problem. When I first got here, so always keep that in mind. So I'm going to heal myself just in case. Go head back and talk to that person.
and hopefully they'll join up with the Minutemen. Okay, so looks like she's right over okay. here. You find those raiders? I took care of those raiders for you. No kidding. That's the best piece of news we've had around here for a good long time. So we've been talking. We decided if you came through for us, we'd join up with the Minutemen again. If we want things to get better, we've got to start helping each other. So we're in. You can count on us if you need help down the line. Thanks again, friend. Why, you're welcome. Now let's go back to Sanctuary and talk to the boss. You know that settlement you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person for the job. By the way, you should have one of these flare guns. You can use it to signal for help from any nearby Minutemen. Not much use yet, but once we have more allied settlements, you'll have help whenever you need it. So, there's something I need to ask you. I guess you know I'm one of the last of the Minutemen. But I never really told you what happened to us. Are you really the last Minuteman? Maybe not literally. There must be a lot of former Minutemen out there who gave it up in disgust after the Quincy Massacre. But we were the last active group of Minutemen. And now, well, it's just me. What was the Quincy Massacre? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that by now. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary group called the Gunners was attacking Quincy. The people there called for the Minutemen to help. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turned their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead, so I ended up in charge of the survivors. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended and conquered. As long as you don't give up, the Minutemen will survive. I'm not about to give up, but I can't protect the Commonwealth all by myself. Hell, I could barely protect these people. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you can. Why can't you lead the Minutemen? That's not who I am. I can get my men through a firefight. I can defend a perimeter against all odds. But that's not going to be enough to bring the Minutemen back from the brink. We need someone who can bring the whole Commonwealth together in a common cause. And I think you've got it in you to be that leader. What makes you think I can do this? You saved us and conquered. There wasn't anything in it for you. You had your own problems to deal with. But you did it anyway. That kind of selflessness has been in mighty short supply around here for quite a while. Okay. I'll do it. Good. Good. Welcome aboard. I feel like this is a whole new star for the Minutemen. And the Commonwealth, too. Don't worry. I'll be right beside you all the way, General. Why are you calling me General? The leader of the Minutemen has always held the rank of General. Our last leader was General Becker. After he died back in 82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last minute man is, there's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new general. Now it's your job to make it more than an empty title. I've got something a bit different for you. That 
with an awkward silence. Our scouts have found a promising spot for a new settlement. The that trouble is that some kind of vicious right beasts are lairing there. Once you clear it out, set up a radio beacon to let settlers know about it. Before you know it, we'll have a thriving new farm instead of wasteland. We'll take back the Commonwealth, one piece at a time. Here's a thing. You got it, uh, boss. So uh, note, guess, Thanks for uh, the promotion. Here, it means a lot to me. And I'll, um, Diamond City surplus. I won't. Now open I won't disappoint you. Management reserves the right to refuse service to anyone. So Especially let's go take that drive in. Next, uh, uh, well, I thought I'd play the ink spots with, um, maybe. I mean, th that's what it's called. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got a quick question for anybody watching. So, I've been playing Black Ops 3 while I'm not playing this, but I kept getting a connection interrupted every time I played online. So I thought it was just because I had a NAT type that was like strict, but then I changed, I did what I had to to change it to open, and I thought that would fix it, but it still gives me connection interrupted every time I play online. If anybody knows how to fix it, and you can let me know, that would be great. It's really annoying can't even play a second of the game without getting it. But anyways, we're here, and it looks like the problem is mole rats. Nothing hard. Just got my trusty shotgun. And we're gonna play a little bit of a whack-a-mole. And they're trying to gang up on my boy dog meat. Hell nah. I got you, dog meat. Oh, no. Dog meat got himself. Dog meat with the takedown. Oh, there's the takedown. I thought he was gonna do that a lot sooner. Okay, so now. For anybody who doesn't know how to nice. set up that like beacon, it's under power, and for some reason, I can't find it. Maybe under miscellaneous, oh there it is, it's under miscellaneous and power. So then you have to connect it to a generator, which is still in power. You can just use a small generator for now. You can always scrap it and make like a big or medium one, depending on if you actually want to build this place up into uh, like a base which I'm probably going to do. Nice big open space. So now, back to the boss. Or am I the boss now because I'm a general? Let's see what he has to say once this stops loading. Now, where is he? It looks like he's over here in the house. Did you happen to clean this house your as your own? Take care of you. 
I cleared out that spot you sent me to and set up a radio beacon there. That's great news. Once folks have some place to call their own, they'll be willing to help defend it. As usual, I have something else for you to look into. I've gotten word about a settlement that's being threatened by raiders. I'll mark it on your map. We'll find out what they need. We could use more settlements supporting our cause. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video.